All right, you guys are going to need two things. You're going to need this crossword puzzle, and you guys are going to need a calendar. When you get the calendar, I want you guys to cut it like you see it like this, right across there, okay? Second thing you're going to do is you are going to glue it into your ISN. What pages do you think, you're, what pages do you think this is going to be glued into? 9 and 10. All right, I'm going to give you guys five minutes to do that. I shall give you guys six minutes. I'm feeling generous. Every day, you guys are going to fill out one of these blanks in the calendar. So obviously today we're going to do uh, September 11. So. What you write in the calendar is what we are going to do today. On page 7 of your ISN, we're going to talk about discipline. On page 8 of your ISN, we're going to talk about my expectations. On page 9 and 10, we're going to just glue in our first six weeks calendar. We already done that. And then finally, you guys are going to have your homework. Your homework is going to be this pink crossword puzzle. Can anyone guess when it's due? Tomorrow. How did you get that? Right there. I expect you to write all of these down. Every day you're going to write something like this all down. And if you ever ask me when something due, I'm going to say check your ISN. Is this for my benefit? No, this is to help you stay organized. All right, I'm going to give you guys like three minutes to write that. Three minutes and a half. All right, my first expectation is, this is on your page 8 and 7 on your ISN. I want you to write these down. My first expectation is, while well, I am talking, no one else is. Okay? My second expectation is, please follow my instructions. So I already gave you an instruction. It was to write these two things down in your ISN. If you choose not to follow those two rules, first thing that will happen will be a verbal warning and or a change in the seating assignment. You don't need to write this, this part here. You, just have, you can just write verbal warning. But I might change where you sit. Second time you do it, I'll call or email your parents and or your coaches. Third time, I, third time it happens, you'll be given a teacher detention. Typically, I'll make you guys clean stuff up. Start talking while I'm talking. Then finally, if it keeps happening the fourth time, perhaps the fourth time, you'll be sent to the office. Okay, I'm going to give you guys one, two, three, four, five, about five minutes to. All right, I know I misspelled Schoology. In Schoology, there's two things I want to show you. First thing I want to show you is my calendar I made. So inside Schoology, if you go to calendar, you're going to see this calendar here. This calendar has several links. So let's say we missed Thursday. You can go here, you can click Worksheet 3.1, and it'll pull up Worksheet 3.1. You could... I need to move this out of the way. Yeah, we did that. You can hit my lecture notes. This is the actual notes I write. So this is what the notes we did on Thursday. This is probably actually your class's notes. And then finally, we have our video lecture. You hear me? They say I sound really mean. Mm -hmm. So, those are resources for you. Please use them if you miss a day or if you don't understand something. See, I actually do require it. I'm not just doing it for show, right? And I'll let this go for everyone. All right. There's your calendar. The second thing I want to show you is going to be your I. A virtual ISN. So if you get lost or you don't know what, you know, maybe you forgot your ISN, maybe you're behind, 
we can go here and make your ISN look like my ISN. This is what we did today. It's already updated. There's our calendar for today. I'm going to move it all the way to right here. Okay, so your ISN should look like my ISN. All right, moving on. Any questions? Okay, do these replace your ISNs? No. Is that calendar, that calendar I showed you is different than the calendar in the ISN. That's your resource calendar, okay? That's for finding resources for that day. Your ISN calendar is telling you what's due and what we actually did. Okay, moving on to the next thing. All right, the crossword puzzle. Okay, I'll do one or two of these with you. You're gonna do the rest on your own. Okay, so the first thing I'm gonna say is, someone in third period said, Mr. Rink, Mr. Rink, Mr. Rink, is there, a, is there an answer uh, bank for this? And you know what I said? I said there sure is. You guys know where the answer bank is? Not in your brain. In your ISN. You have the answers to every single one of those questions somewhere in your ISN. I promise you, you do. You just need to look them up if you do not remember it. So, for example, someone give me one you want to. This, number four. Number four says points that do not lie on the same plane. So let's go look at our ISN because we forgot what that is. All right, let's look right here. Points that do not lie on the same plane, correct? Or is it the same line? Number four. All right, so let's look at this first one. Co-linear. Is that what we're looking for? Same line? No, let's go down here. Non-same line, non-collinear. That's closer, right? But we're looking for planes. How about this one here? Non-same plane, non-coplanar. Does that sound like it'll be the right answer? Right there. So we're going to write in our crossword puzzle, non-coplanar. That was number four. Non. Co-planar. Uh, remember, collinear and coplanar, collinear and non-collinear are spelled with two L's. Okay. If you look here, this might trick you. Collinear has two L's. Non-collinear has two L's. Okay. I'll do one more. Which one do you want me to do? Number five. Number five says, points that lie in the same line. Points that lie in the same line. So here's number five. Same line. Let's go look at our ISN again. Co means same, linear means line. Would that be our right answer? Okay. Same line is co-linear. But remember, it's spelled with two L's. Co-linear. All right, you have the rest of this. When is this going to be due? How do you know it's going to be due tomorrow? Because it says so on the calendar. That's why I make you guys write the stuff in the calendar. Okay? All right, you guys can work in groups. You can use your ISN to finish this.